Knees are. I love you guys. Asas pechadas. Desert oh soul. my god! These are the four women who make up the vocal ensemble Sage right after they found out the first song they ever wrote was nominated for a Grammy. It's called Desert Song and here to perform it for us are Sarah, Amanda, Janay and Erin of Sage. <laughs> Someday you will reach the desert Held by the warmth within the skies Breathe in the exhale of the desert And see yourself reflected in her eyes the desert you she's been singing a song of life and love to your surprise you're singing with the desert you've always known the words to sing along you have a voice to share you're coming home where you belong. She's calling. She's calling. Oh, she. She's calling, calling, she's calling, calling, calling. Oh man, I can hear, if, if the studio was full of people, I can hear people gasping right now <laughs> and clapping and I want to hear a standing ovation. I think it's out there in the, in the ether. Um, it's a pretty amazing because uh, your voices, when they are in unison, they are perfectly in unison. And when you harmonize, they are perfectly in harmony and yet, you all had individual careers before you came together, isn't that right? Yeah. yeah. So how did you come together? How did you find this magic? Well, the jazz world is a, is a pretty tight-knit community. Um, we have professional musicians and educators in the ensemble and some of the like truly most genius arranger composers as well. And so we were all aware of each other, um, but you know, wanted to take a leap of faith and see what the sisterhood would reveal. And you all have Northwest roots, uh, except I think, Aaron, you're from Vermont. So right, yeah. if you will step aside, please. Uh, I'm wearing green. And yet you somehow all found each other. It must feel like a little sprinkle of magic really for all of you. Yeah. And then the fact that you, your first song that you wrote together ended up getting a Grammy nomination? Yeah. Where, yeah, did, yeah. where did the song come? Jeanne, where did, where did it, did it just come out of the blue or did no. you somehow really work it? Yeah, we um, were at our first retreat, kind of just getting to know one another, spending time together and connecting. Um, as Sarah said, we'd known of each other, but hadn't like yeah. fully conceived of what Sage would turn into. And we just thought we would spend time and maybe collaborate and see what happens. And we like, sat by this little pool at this Airbnb and started writing something because we had mostly been hanging out right. and we decided we need to have something margaritas. to show for this. <laughs> yes, <laughs> lots of margaritas. Um, we needed something to show for the time that we spent together and 
um, we just committed to sitting down and writing a piece together, and this is what it turned into wow. very quickly. So to those who say that no good can possibly come from a girlfriend's <laughs> weekend out. Exactly. Incorrect. I mean, okay, maybe you trashed a couple hotel rooms in the process. <laughs> that's just, that's just oh, rock and roll. That's, that's, the so way, that's, right. yeah. that's the way it works. So, um, where it, so that's where Desert Song came from. Mm -hmm. um, and, and then what, what do you say the message is of that song? I think a big conversation that we had that week that we were together was that we're all women. We're female identifying composer, arranger, musicians. Um, and so we were kind of like, what a feeling it is to be just in this very feminine space and not feeling like we have to harden or kind of puff up mm. to this more masculine energy that especially within our generation, uh, going through school, going through all of that kind of growing up, yeah. Is, is pretty intense, that's what you get used to. So it was a very distinct feeling to just be the four of us together. And so we were like, L I mean, we can't ignore this, yeah. so let's just try writing a song about this. And then that's your song is what happened. Yeah. yeah, okay, so everybody asks, what's the next big thing? What are we gonna hear next from Ooh. you? We just released our debut album. Yeah. It's like two and a half years in the making. It just came out August 25th, and right now is Grammy voting season. We're up in a couple different categories, Grammy oh, for your consideration. <laughs> um, but we've also, on Friday, are launching into our debut album tour throughout North America. Great. I'm really excited about. So when people say, where can I find your music? What, that's kind of an open-ended question. Everywhere. Everywhere. All the places, yes right here right now uh, but uh, that's fantastic well you can see sage perform this friday october 13th at the earshot jazz festival at town hall seattle thank you so much for blessing us with your beautiful music and uh, we're so glad to have you all here as what we claim a great northwest vocal ensemble <laughs> thank, thank you so much